Hello and welcome chicken. Welcome back to Minecraft Mine Colonies 119.2. We are still in the process of actually building or upgrading the university. And I decided because we are at 97% completion of the university that this would be a great moment to start uh, recording again. Because I thought that, well, we got pretty far. Uh, might as well just show you guys how far we are with the build. And what are you running off to, dude? Oh, he's a developer. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> All right, he's doing his thing. All right, this is the university as it stands. We got a bunch more stuff, a whole bunch of glass in the front. So now you can see actually into the uh, university office, which is quite nice. And uh, more, well, I think these plants are all mine. I think that I put these plants down here. They'll probably get removed in a bit once the uh, builder is actually done with, with most of the construction. We'll see. All right, anyways, we have a, the tower has been increased from down there or something like that, that height to that height, at least, at least three blocks. The roof has been increased in height as well by at least two blocks in some spots. And uh, we have now got a shingled roof all the way around, which is quite nice. I like that. And then there, right, um... There's also been a kind of a connection between the separate buildings. This this used to be a completely separate ah I broke my leg, uh, separate building, and it's now part of the entire enclosed um, structure. So now we have a roof that goes all the way around. Oh, yeah, I like that very much. And now we have, of course, got a little bit of a, a courtyard here, which is quite cool. So we have a roof that goes all the way around, and then we have a beautiful little courtyard. Made my foot <laughs> and then she's there's my builder she's doing her thing all right we'll get back to this in a bit uh, i'm in the wrong place here uh and we'll check out what it looks like once she's actually completed all the the work um in the meantime i need to go across to the other side of the river because um my builder over there uh, might need a little bit of help so i did assist in the construction of the tower um the guard tower uh, over here that one is done uh, so the old tower that we built ourselves uh that i built uh, has been removed and has been replaced with this little guard tower so now we of course we don't have a guard because we don't we don't have the population that's why we're doing the entire upgrade right so we don't have the uh, the, the population and we can't really force any of my soldiers to go in there because they are all they all have their own houses and stuff. So we all just need to wait until we get some more pop. Anyways, um, so that's been done. Uh, we also have this uh, tower here upgraded. Oh, can I even get in there? Oh, yeah, I can. Good. So you, you're, sure, you're supposed to come on through here, then go through here, then go down in here. And then this is supposed to be the tower uh, where my guards are. Of course, there's only one because I don't have enough population. Uh, but um, I don't see how they're supposed... This is the only way out for them. Right? Climbing up these stairs. I mean, this ladder. And then making their way through here. Going across this thingy. And then coming to the stairs and going down. I don't really find that very efficient. <laughs> uh, I would think that it would be much nicer to have a door somewhere around here. Maybe this... Turn this into a door. Turn this into a door. That would have been better, right? But we'll leave it for now. We'll see what happens uh, as we progress. This is going to have to be upgraded to level 3 eventually. And then we'll get some more towers. And then we'll get some more so, uh, troops and stuff. And then we can go to war with the pirates. <laughs> Anyways. We also have this building completed. Um, this is the residence. The third residence in this line. Um, because we have three buildings here. We have the lumberjack, we have the miner, and we have the builder, right? So the builder over there. And they are supposed to live on this little bit of uh, the east. Is the east, right? No, the west. The west uh, expansion, right? Yeah, the west expansion of the village. So I need to set... I need to check first who lives here. This is the builder. So Tia, Tiana, 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 Tiana. She hasn't gone to bed, and she doesn't seem to want to do anything anymore. I think I'm going to have to fire her, maybe kill her. I don't know. She doesn't, doesn't, doesn't want to go to bed. So I, I can't get her to... to, to that's, not my, that's not my spot point. <laughs> I can't get her to go to bed. So nobody has slept because of that woman. <laughs> so Tiana lives, Tiana lives in that one. 
in this one we have Mauricio so Mauricio lives in that one so maybe we just close this door and see what happens I'm gonna I'm gonna recall her to the builders hut just to make sure that she actually gets out of the house because she doesn't seem to want to be doing anything so I'm, I'm pretty sure there's still stuff to build I'm just not quite sure why she's not doing anything Let's just recall her over to here yeah you just just stay here okay yeah good day just, to you. yeah good day to you too I'm kind of miss it pissed at you all right so um Mauricio who is Mauricio Mauricio is that's Tobias hey, Tobias Tobias I think Mauricio must be this guy. Yeah, Mauricio is the forester. So that's Mauricio. Mauricio uh, tenders to the forest here, tends to the forest here, and makes sure, of course, that whatever sprouts out of this ground is um, is his to control. Of course, he's not very good at planting trees. But <laughs> uh, no worries about that. We'll get that done. So we're going to get Tobias to live in this hut here. So we're going to go ahead... And mm, homelessness, the guy. <laughs> Let's go to manage housing. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Override automatic manual. So I want Tobias Guber. Works 46 blocks from here. Currently works distance. Uh, work distance. Blah, blah blah. 187. That's how far he actually has to travel before he can get to work. Everybody else, except for of course Keenan. I, I don't know where Keenan lives. I don't know where why he has to travel 107 blocks or 108 blocks with Amari. I don't know why these travel have to travel so far, but they do. Um, everybody else seems to be just under the hundred, which is quite nice. Uh, blah, 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 blah. So I want Tobias here to live here. So there we go. And then we'll just put back the default. Nope. So Tobias B. Gooder. Um, he's a he's a Gooder boy. Uh, lives here now so now he doesn't have to travel so far from over there to here and that should improve his happiness a little bit so if we're going to manage houses there you go like I say it works 46 blocks from here lives here yeah <laughs> so he doesn't he doesn't tra have to travel that far which is kind of kind of nice we'll, we'll 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 try and make the um the whole like people business thingy where they live and where they work and stuff like a little more more efficient later on but for now this is probably gonna be it. why why are you still not doing anything and do we do i need to tell you something to do do i need to give you something to do i'll give you something to do let's see what can you do? what can you do what can you do i do want to have this mine upgraded so let's go ahead and build options let's put this in upgrade ah block of coal dirt cobblestone stairs frame cobblestone blah blah blah, 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 blah. okay nothing really spectacular all right we'll get we'll get her We'll get um, Tiana here to work on the upgraded mine. That will give us a level 2 mine. So now we need to, of course, give her that that and some cobblestone stairs. Do I have any cobble on me? I do not. Uh, and you wasted a whole bunch of cobble on the university. Cobblestone frames, cobblestone dirt, dark oak wood, um, dark oak slab, blah, blah, blah. We can get all that. But first, let's go back to the university, make sure that she's actually working on that. I need that university done. You, sorry about that. Mm, ta -da -da -da, ta -da -da. I need to eat something. Let's just enjoy the fishies. Look at them. Strange little fishies, aren't they? they keep coming to the surface and something and then, then go back down again. I saw a drowned over there once. He's, he's just hanging around. I'm not quite sure if he's still there. Anyways, let's go back to the university. Boop, 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 boop. You don't want to ju jump into the water. The water is dangerous around here. <laughs> what happened here? Oh yeah, so this is this is okay. Let's check out what the what the percentage of the completion of the work is at the moment. It is at 97%. Why is it still 97%? Um, dirt and stuff. Add. We need to get that to the other builder, but for now... Why, why is this not done yet? I mean, it's, it looks done, right? What's, what are you waiting for? Let's look for the, let's look for the builder. Oh, there's, there is uh, Maya. Maya. <laughs> uh, you probably get teased with that a lot, don't you, Maya? Okay, Maya, Maya, Maya. Oh, she's going. All right. All right, let's go get some stuff and let's go and um, give uh, our builder on the side of the river some something some some good stuff. All right, so we need some coal because I need to make a block of coal. Block of coal, done. 
check your recipe book. I don't need to. I know exactly what I just did. Uh, do I have any... This is framed cobblestone. So let's, let's just take that. I think that might be what she needs. I'm going to grab some slabs of cobblestone as well. Hey, do I not have any more cobblestone? I thought I had more cobblestone. I have stone. I need some dirt as well. I only have two dirt. <laughs> It's pathetic, I know. There we go. That's a whole bunch more dirt. Dark oak logs. I think I need that as well. Um, what is this? This is spruce planks. No. no. Uh, let's grab some more cobblestone slabs. Let's grab some stairs as well, just in case she needs that. We have a chainmail helmet here. Yeah, I keep getting them from the pirates that I keep des destroying, demolishing. Um, let's see. What else do we have to have? I think we just have to go into the mine and get a little bit more cobble. I don't I don't have any more cobble here. Yeah. So let's go let's go in the mine, let's get some more cobble. I shouldn't have I should have still have I should still have some cobble left in these chests. Because I did mine quite a considerable amount. Um, yeah, there we go. So grab some of that. Two of that should be more than enough. And then I think everything else is dark oak logs, I think. That's what we need. Dark oak wood. So we don't need to get more or much more. So I think we're good. I think we're golden. All right. Now I don't know how I can force my build on the side of the river to go to sleep, but it's getting dark. So let's go and make sure that everybody over here is um, back in the city, back in the town. Because we're not a city yet. We're not a city yet. We are still a hovel <laughs> with only 25, 20 people, whatever. All right. That's one of you. Where's the other one? Dude, you coming? Uh, I don't want to go over there and see if he's, if, he's, if he's coming or not. You okay, dude? It seemed like he was enjoying himself. I don't want I don't want your flesh to away. All right, so there's nothing else here. That's good. I don't think anybody's coming from that side. Let's go back into the city or into the town. And let's go across the bridge and make sure that those people over there are also going to bed. Because they don't like sleeping. <laughs> they don't like being told that they have to go to bed. They hate it. Now let's see. Um, they all sleep on that side of the river. So I don't have to worry about them crossing. But I do have to worry about them actually getting to bed safely. Because if they can't get to bed safely, they'll you know, most likely get eaten. Obviously, the hello Guber, Guder, 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 Hezekiel. Oh, whoa! I didn't push it that hard, did I? Ezekiel Guder. <laughs> All right, let's just make sure everybody gets to bed. You, ow! You touched me. I need to also make sure these these little balls of fur die. Ow! Do you mind? Why are you guys coming after me? Ah, thank you. <laughs> that wasn't very useful, but... Mauricio! What are you doing? Well, why are you standing over here? My troops are defending this guy. They're making sure that, uh, that Mauricio is not going to die. There goes Mauricio. Now, I need to make sure that Lady, Lady Macdeath over here is actually in bed. Oh, she's in bed. She's in bed. She's back in bed again. So three days. Oh, let's go. Three days of oh, something blew up. Three days of non-sleep is now finally over. We can go to bed. <laughs> oh, it's been such a long time. I haven't felt my bed, the mattress, for such a long time. It must now be covered in dust and full of spiders and spider webs. I don't know. All right, let's go jump in bed. Poo. There we go. Just something to drink. Take a sip. Oh, good stuff. All right. Everybody, wakey, wakey. Good stuff. Fisherman, I gave him a fisher rod, fishing rod. Yeah, he's okay now. Look at him go. Look at him go. I mean, I could hire these guys, right? I could hire Hugh Jackman over here. Jew Hackman, right? Jude Hackman. Uh, I uh, but I don't have that much lapis. I mean, I could go get it, right? I mean, I can I can probably get him to join the military. 
Now, I, I have some empty houses. I could probably convince him to, to join. You know, let's let's just try it. Let's try it. Let's try it. Let's try it. Right? Let's see what happens. We are we are in a little bit of a discovery period. Right? Let's see if we can get some lapis from this guy from this 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 tun tunnel over here. Not here. Down here. Yeah, we go. So what? Nothing. Let's see. There, there it is. Let's grab that. It's not gonna be enough, is it? I only got like twenty nine. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> I only I only see like oh there is some there's something there. All right, so let's grab some more. I really really want to have one of my pickaxes um, enchanted with with fortune, but I don't think it's gonna happen. Let's go and hire that guy that we saw. I mean he's useless, totally useless because he has no skills whatsoever. But I want to see, I want to see what happens if we hire him, even though we are at the max population that our village can uh, allow. I want to see if it's possible. It's possible. Alright, let's see, where do you go? There he is, there he is, there he is. Hello, huge uh, Jackman. Recruit for 30 lapis. Okay, recruit. Haha! -ha. Alright, so it did work, I think. It only doesn't have enough space for another... Uh, okay, so I can't. I do have space. I have lots of space. <laughs> I can't. I can't hire him. So it won't allow me to hire him. So that's too bad. All right, we just we just, we harvested the lapis for no particular reason. We'll just put it in the in the warehouse here, and then we'll go check on our build and make sure that she's actually doing so. Uh, yeah, well, scary as hell, man. <laughs> well, he's standing there for nothing. Ah, uh, that's a lot of eggs. Who in their right mind collects that many eggs? Uh, all right, let's go put that below the leather tunic, tunic thing over there as well. All right, let's go and see. Do we have any, like, wood here? We have some more dark oak logs. Beautiful, beautiful. And a couple of slabs. I think, I think this should do nicely. Let's go across the river. Let's go supply. Oh, don't step on the chicken. Chickens are evil. And they will peck you to death. I've seen it happen. 97% still. Let's go and recall the the worker, the builder. Make sure that she's actually doing the thing. Yes, go in there. Do your thing. <coughs> <laughs> Why is it so high? All right, so that she's going up there. What did she just put down? Oh. Uh. Hey. Oh, no. <laughs> Ah, she's removing stuff. Good. Good. Good, good, good. That means she's almost done. That means she's almost done. And then we can check out the university properly and get started. Okay, this is the wrong door again. And get started on the actual um, upgrade. Uh, the, 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 the research that we need to get the population to grow again. So we can grow. That building is looking at me. See those little two eyes? It's looking at me. It's evil. All right, let's go across. Let's just make sure that my builder has everything she needs, and then she can start working on the uh, upgrade for the um, the mine. I don't think it'll be enough to get us the uh, the full three mines thingy, right? That we need, uh, but it's a start. Okay, let's go get that done. That done. Do two blocks of coal. No, <laughs> I thought it was only one. <laughs> All right, well let's go, let's make some more slabs. That's how you make slabbies. Slabs. Um, boom. Oh, we, need, we need four more. Four more slabs. Boop. Is that enough? Are you happy now? Yes. All right. Take it. Take it. Coarse dirt. I, I thought it was just normal dirt. And frame cobble. Okay. Dark oak log wood. Uh, we, we have dark oak logs. Why do we... Uh, how, how do we... Hey, how do we get this? <laughs> okay. Let's, let's look for dark oak wood that there's that wood that's the what we want and that's just okay almost, we'll just we'll do that i guess right is that what you wanted yes we need three more just give me that there we go so that should be enough to fill that requirement accent the coarse dirt and the block we need, to, we need more coal we need more coal i don't think there's any coal in there why there's stone in there i don't know but 
Okay, there are blocks of coal, uh, coarse dirt, and the framed cobblestone. Because this framed cobblestone apparently is not what she wants. Hmm. I'm going to give it to you anyway. Like so. A framed cobblestone, crafting the architect's cutter, double crossed. Dark oak planks, cobblestone. Uh, okay. Let's go try this. Do this. We need cobblestone, dark oak logs, uh, dark oak wood, and it has to be double crossed. We can do that. We can do. Uh, did you just jump into that post? What? Why? Hmm. All right. Questions. Questions. Lots of questions that I don't want to know the answer to. I also wondering why that's not done yet. <laughs> we. Are, how close are we? We are at ninety-seven percent now. <laughs> It's always the same thing. Okay, coarse dirt. Coarse dirt. Coarse dirt requires gravel. We should have some gravel around here somewhere. It's dirt. Coarse dirt. Coarse dirt. Coarse dirt. Gravel. 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 That's an aside. Don't. I don't. Why don't I have any gravel? Why? Why? Where is all my gravel gone to? I want my gravel back. I, mean, I know I have more gravel. Oh, let's do this first then. We need a uh, cobblestone, cobblestone, and oak wood, blah, 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 like that. And we want the double crossed. Uh, uh, where is it? Is it? No, that's not one. That's not the one. This is the one. Double crossed type material, dark oak plant. Let's just try and see if we get. This is given like 12. That should be enough. Let's go make some more coal because we need like a, a lot more coal. You do, 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 beautiful. Two more coal. Should be good. And let's go get some, um, some, some gravel so we can make the, uh, what do you call it again? The, 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 <laughs> oh, I went too far. Here, no, here, uh, gravel. Perfect. 16 gravel. That's good enough. We can do this right here. Boom, boom. And then you there, there. That gives me coarse dirt. Excellent. We got 32 coarse dirt, more than enough. Uh, backup has started. Excellent. Um, now we should be, ha we should have everything. If, if, right? If, if I got the double cross thingy correct. If I didn't, um, well, then we'll be back here soon. Because <laughs> I, I currently only have one of these the architect's cutters. I mean, I can probably make another one, architect cutter. Let's see, what does it need to make an architect cutter? What do we need to do that? Uh, okay, I don't have that. I, I don't have any of that. <laughs> so I can't I can't make an architect cutter now at the moment. We would have to go to the nether uh, or and look for some warped wood. I don't think I have the time for that yet. We'll go to the nether some other time, and then we'll take some of these guys with us. Uh, make sure that we have a little fortress there. Uh, put a little colony there as well, probably, yeah. See what we can do. Yeah, look at them go down. Excellent. So we have the block hole, the coarse dirt. I think I got the wrong way around, didn't I? So this is, yeah, it's the wrong way around. So we need to have cobble on the inside, wood on the outside. That's what that is supposed to say. Okay, so we did, we did get it wrong. <laughs> Uh, let's see what we can do. Yeah. Not good. Not good. Okay, let's, let's, okay, so it, it needs to have the cobble on the inside and the wood on the outside, right? We have it the other way around, where we have the wood on the outside, uh, inside, and the cobble on the outside. That doesn't make any sense. Let's do like this, and then boom, and that gives us frame cobblestone, double cross, that's what we want, I think. Right, right, right. So if it's, it's not, if it's if it's wrong, it's your fault. <laughs> yeah, I'm pointing at myself here. Don't worry, not you guys. There's no way that you could be influencing me unless one of you has the power. I don't think it's gonna be happening. All right, let's see if we can get this done. Ah, itch my nose. Okay, let's see. Yes, it's done. We have 100% supplied. Beautiful. So that is all we needed to get this uh, group of loosely put together pieces of stuff <laughs> upgrade to level two, which currently isn't much. Hello? Hello? Anybody down there? Oh, he's coming up. Hello, Mr. Gooder. 
Tobias B. Gooder. He's the goodest of his family. Had to sneeze there for a second. Didn't want to show my sneeze face. So this is this is what you get to see. A little pause in the recording. Let's continue. All right, everybody, everything here seems to be good. I'm just going to put a little torchy porchy uh, over there. And I'm going to torch, torch you there. And then one over there, yonder, yes. And also one here, because I think it's a little bit darky dark. I'm not quite sure why I'm talking this way, because it sounds stupid. There. There. And there. Don't mind me, I'm just... Putting stuff on your, uh, I'm in a hole. Putting stuff in your, uh, on your house. This is good. This is good. Okay, that's that. The neighborhood now over here seems to be a little bit more lit up, which is exactly what I want. I mean, the coast over here until this point here is pretty much non-existent. I mean, they, they, nothing can get in because right, it's too high, right, <clears throat> from the outside, unless of course they're pirates. Because they can put down stairs, uh, uh, ladders, and then climb up. Let's put that there as well. Yeah, excellent. I, I want to put a torch here too, because it was a little bit dark. That's good. All right, I will. I will lit, light up this place and make it a little bit prettier uh, in 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 uh, the next episode, whatever um, later on, uh, to make it look a little bit more homey, uh, homely. But for now, I think that will be good. Why is everybody on the roof? Get off the roof, kids! Bloody children. <laughs> Look at them. One of them drinks too much, the other one just... They follow each other all over the place. I'm not quite sure. They're, they're probably attached by the hip. Oh. That, that, that came out wrong. That means something else. Yeah, sorry about that. They are not... Okay, you know, I'm, I'm, not gonna, I'm gonna stop talking about that. <laughs> Alright, let's go see if we can find and rescue the people out there. Oh, the guards are running for their... Oh, ships! I knew it. Forrester Sarah Garnier is dead. Oh, whoa! It's war out here. Oh, ships. No, no. Don't go after my miner. Run, dude. Run. He was almost dead, too. We got, we got a, we got one of you coming this way. Fight to the death! There we go. Dude, run! He doesn't want to run. He doesn't want to run. He doesn't want to run. <laughs> what do we do with him? He's in a state of panic. He's like, he's refusing to move. His legs can't carry him anymore. Oh, now he goes. There he goes. It's all over. The troops did a good job, I think. They came to the rescue of the uh, forester. Uh, it didn't work, sad enough. So I think somebody took all her stuff. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna put a torch there because I I feel that that needs a little torchy torch. Why am I talking this way? What have I done to deserve this? All right, so that's we lost we lost a loyal um, forester. It's a bit too bad. It's, it's sad. It's sad. So now let's go ahead and manage workers. Let's just put this one on manual, so nobody gets employed here. Show unemployed, so show employed, yeah, yeah, sure, sure. Um, so that nobody gets employed, so I can remove this building completely, because I don't want it here anymore. I want it gone. We need it to be gone because um, I, ne I need to put it outside of the colony. And we want to upgrade it to level 2. Boom. Carrots. All, all the other things that I don't really want. Why can I pick up? I want to pick you up. That's good. That stuff is not important. The building itself is. So, okay. Next episode, we'll plant that building outside of the village. Over, like, somewhere over here. <coughs> right? Like, like there or something. Oh, shit. Aha! You hit me in the nuts. <laughs> why are you so mean? Oh, take that. Oh, he was just paying. He was just faking it. I'm not quite sure how how fire actually hurts skeletons, but I'm not gonna question it. Everybody in bed yet? Is everybody in, except for the dead one. Is everybody in bed yet? 
I, th I think that everybody should be in bed, right? Is nobody in bed? No, nah, ships. Nobody in bed yet. Why do I have an apple? I can, I can hit somebody with an apple. I'll hit you with an apple. Bam, bam, bam. Does a massive amount of damage. Especially to doctors. Alright, so you guys want me to drink? Take a sip. I'm gonna sleep because I don't, I don't want to wait three more days with that woman on the other side of the river to sleep. Alright. Okay. Everything else seemed to be good, except, of course, the forester. We lost that one. So we're gonna have a child be born into the village soon. Fisherman doing his job. Beautiful. You know, as I, I have a fisherman, but I have not seen a fish in the village so far yet. So I don't know if he's actually doing his job. <laughs> I'm just going to assume that he does. Fishing, I like fishing. Fishing is not one of those, you know, like, like working in IT. It's, a, it's not a grace, not, a, not a, a job that doesn't, it's very thankless, you know. <clears throat> not used yet okay so the, being a fisherman it's it's where well, first of all it's a relaxing activity right you're just waiting for a fish to bite you also get the satisfaction of killing a fish right so that's also quite nice and then right oh sorry look at the mine cool thank you and then you also take the fish and you can feed the people that you like and you can poison and feed the people that you don't like. So it's a double thing. It's 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 two ways. Being a fisherman is just it's just positive, one hundred percent. There's nothing wrong with being a fisherman, except for maybe having to touch the fish. Uh, but for the rest, it's it's a probably a very very good job. I like fishing. Being, being a fisherman would be quite nice. Right nowadays, of course, uh, all these shows on like Discovery Channel about these fishermen in the in the Bering Sea and stuff like that nah, that's not like that's not that, mm, that's not a good job <laughs> that's not a good job that's a bad job all right so the builder is at 97 percent we have to do a, a whole oh, bunch of dirt and you she still has to put like 572 dirt I'm not quite sure where she's gonna put it That's a lot of dirt. Is she going to cover the entire university in dirt? What is she doing with all that dirt? Where's all that dirt going? And I'm kind of concerned. What, where? Why does she need all that dirt for? <laughs> what is she using that dirt for? I'll, I'm also kind of un unhappy with the fact that I can't uh, walk up here anymore. Right, the 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 path that was here before with the stairs and everything has been removed, and now I can't get back up this way. So the only way you can get up that way uh, is just by cheating, basically, by going across the roof, like Spiderman, um, and making your way into the university, and then robbing the university people blind, and then making your way escape through the front. That's what you do now. So she did take away all the bushes and stuff, right? all the leaves that I planted and stuff, right? uh, and instead put down a whole bunch of flowers. So um, yay for her, bad for me, I guess. What are you doing? I can help you with that. No, I touched her again. She's gonna stop for two minutes. Bloody hell! <laughs> there she goes. Don't touch the builders. They just get confused. They they've never been touched in their entire lives. It's it's a it's a natural instinct of theirs to to freeze, and then contemplate their existence for two minutes or a minute or a couple of seconds, um, unknown. Uh, but that's what they do. All right. So, anyways, because we because we've gotten this far with the university, I think it's about time that we did. I can help you with that. No, you can't. Stop telling me that you can help. You can't help for ships. All right. So this is this is quite quite cool. Okay, let's see. Maybe we can get into the university, into the university, and just show you guys around a bit. This is the front, I think, because I think this is the front. I think this is the front. I don't know if that is the front, because <clears throat> there's also a hole there, and I don't know if that's the front. 
or that's the front or that's the front <laughs> i don't know uh, but anyways i'm gonna assume this is the front because it's a, got a big big opening in it right so anyways we got two buildings that building and this building or this structure and that structure and they're um linked together with this massive spanning roof uh, that goes from the tower all the way across to that side. I can you can see that probably. And then we have the beautiful windows with some beautiful siding, uh, close the closing the gaps and stuff. So the little uh, oh, what do you call those things again? Mm. Hatches, right? Window hatches, right? So you can close the windows. Uh, well, not 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 really. This is Minecraft, so you can't. But you can make it look like you're actually closing the window, right? And that's just as important, I guess. Anyways. So you can look inside whatever they're doing in there. I don't know what. We'll get in there in a bit. In a bit. Um, then over here, you have another window that looks into the office. That's the main building block over there. Uh, beautiful window. It's a nice looking tall window. And some more siding. Did you, did you hear somebody put something down? I thought I heard the builder do some things. Oh, don't touch her. Don't touch her. Ah! <laughs> She's putting down grasses. So confusing. This is the massive tower. You can just barely see inside. There's a staircase that goes to the top. It has a little bit of, a uh, little bit of windows and stuff. I'm not entirely sure why a university needs a tower, though. I know that some universities have towers. I just don't know why. It's just un it's unknown to me. It's un it's a, it's foreign. I don't know why a university would need a, a, a defense tower. Anyways, this one does. So it goes. It's a uh, multi-layered. Um, then we'll say we have a lot of stones. Most of the walls have been replaced. Most of the wood has been replaced with, with cobble. And we have this very kind of uh, textured wall. I'm guessing it's a textured wall. I'm not quite sure why they else why else they would put like a whole bunch of uh, these these staircases like that all the way around. That's I like that though. That's pretty cool, right? And there's little gaps here. And then this is the chimney, the main chimney. Let's let's take the stairs. I don't want to break my feet again. And then from here we have the back, which I'm going to assume is the back, because I don't know. It could be. It could just as well be this side, right? All right, university's done. Yay! What, did you need to put like 512 dirt blocks down? I, <laughs> I'm so confused. Anyways, beautiful back uh, of the building. So we still have all these beautiful windows that, that look out. I think there's no windows. I can't see. Yeah, there are windows. There are windows, right? So you can see directly through that out into the into the into the compound and then all the way across to here and then of course we need to just go on the window i mean up the stairs the ladder here so we can check out the, the last bit of the of the outside <laughs> jump up there we go so that is the rear i mean the front the uh, the other side <laughs> of the building that's a massive gap there i think that's a door i'm not quite sure what we'll we'll open it up eventually and then use that to get down to there that'll be probably a good idea anyways that is the uh outside of the exterior of the university let's go inside we'll get to the roof in a bit all right so you come in through here beautiful high ceiling i love it and you have the beautiful uh framed uh siding uh, also pretty cool, nice and light, the white and the very dark wood, beautiful. And then in here we have a, I think it's an apothecary, it's a bookshelf, never mind. Uh, I think this is just a little study area where you can study as a student and contemplate your existence as a, you look up at the sky, that's quite nice. I'm pretty sure your books would get wet if it rained in here. Alright, but that's that's the little study area. And then we have the main library, I mean the main uh, office, uh, same little setup, little chair, uh, the main building block, the university block, that's like a, a desk, it's actually a book in one of these little cupboards, I mean this sh uh, these, these little uh, drawers, right? <laughs> and you have some more bookshelves, I love the roof, look how high it is now, we've got this beam that goes across. And then we have a roof that goes all the way. This, it's pretty high, right? With a nice, beautiful siding as well. Look at that. And that's a beautiful, beautiful ceiling. We have a nice little courtyard with some roses and some grasses. This is one of the grasses that we, we picked, of course. Then we have the university cantina. So you can sit here and eat everything that you want to eat and drink everything that you want to drink. I'm assuming they, they have beer. 
Um, and then this, of course, here's where they bake all their breads and stuff uh, and make all the th Why is that wood not burning? Is that wood supposed to burn? I don't know. There's two, there's two campfires in here now, so it's extra smoky. It's all good. All right, and then here, oh, hello. Maya here. Okay, Maya is still here. I'm not quite sure why. All right, now we have a little sitting seating area here that you can look out of. Not much because it's... Uh, the dirt is, the sand is just blocking most of the exit, uh, the, the view. And then we have the path up here towards the top of the tower. And from here, you can watch the beautiful sunset. And you can have a, a gorgeous view of the village. And of course, uh, across the, uh, the, 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 the bridge to the other side. Look at that. Isn't it gorgeous? Oh, uh, yes. <laughs> Oh, I like the the rooftop as well. This is this is beautiful. Now I'm not quite sure why this hasn't covered by a rooftop or why this isn't closed off. I mean, they they could have just gone from that to the, to that, but they didn't. This this is a little opening here. I'm not sure why, but we'll uh, leave it alone. It's, it, it looks good. It looks good. We also have a double roof set up here. Oh no! Buckled with some darn raiders coming from the northeast. Northeast over that way again. Uh, okay, we're well, fine. We'll get to that in a bit, but we have uh, another attack coming, I guess. All right, but that's that's pretty much the university. And then of course we'll do the upgrade um, to uh, outpost. As soon as we have Keen, then we have to have three books. Then we can research Keen. That will allow us to research Outpost. And increase the um, the overall size of the village. But for now, I'm going to go close the doors. Yes, <laughs> so nobody can get in. I don't want I don't want our little friends, the uh, raiders, to get into the village. Not tonight, at least. Let's just make sure that um, my miner gets inside. Thank you very much. Get in. Get in. Close the doors. Good. That's very good. All right. Now, um, that should be good. We don't have to worry about that. Let's get to the front of the, the colony. And then let's close the doors there as well. Lock those doors so they c nobody can get in. And then we'll have no problems whatsoever. I was waiting to build a drawbridge here. Right? So that we could... Uh, oh, hello. Yeah, something's just skeleton. All right, let's just close the doors. Boom, locked. Everything's everything's closed off. Let's go to the to the uh, to the fisherman side as well. Make sure that's also all closed off. And we just we're just locking down the entire village, making sure that nothing gets in and nobody gets left outside, so that the bandits and so on can't come in and they can't raid our village. Which is exactly what we want. We want them not to raid the village. Yes, okay. <laughs> so, nobody out here? Some people out there. All right. Close the doors. Boom, boom. Good. And then this one as well. Yeah, boom. And nobody out? No. Boom. Excellent. So that's good. We only have two more doors to do. The guards are all inside. I'm not quite sure if the fisherman is inside. Nah, it's just one of those hired ladies. You coming inside? No, he's walking around. Jude is Jude Hackman is walking and staying outside. Okay, let's stay. Let's make sure that everybody uh, stays. No, 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 <laughs> get back here. I'm not quite sure if those people are going to be okay, but we'll be okay. Where, where the, where, where the, where the soldier go to? Wasn't he here a second ago? There he is. Get your ass, get your butt back inside, listen to your commander. All right, they can stay outside. Beautiful. All right, now that's all good. Everybody should be inside. Everything should be nice and safe. Everybody should be okie dokie. Let's go and check uh, other side of the river. Make sure that those people are also into bed. Um, and that the front door is locked there. Now, I don't, I don't have a problem with the raiders coming across on that side. It'll be much easier for us to hold them back here because then they will have to cross the bridge, which is heavily defended. Um, but not just that. I have I have way more heavily trained... Oh, did you hear something? I heard something. Yeah, it's a drowned. Uh, way more better trained uh, troops on this side of the river 
and they are eager to take on uh, a bunch of uh, uh, a bunch of sloppy uh Ooh, hello <laughs> let's just close the door shall we thank you very much what, what do you want Word. colonies being raided i am running for shelter then go back home dude you're not running at all i see your legs not moving These, these guys are all just waiting for a chance to use up their weapons. Use their most advanced weapons on the enemy. Yeah, we should be okay. Let's just see what we can see on the radar. I don't see anything coming our way yet. So I think we're still called okie doke. We, I see a whole bunch of drowned in the water, but that should be fine. No! Don't you touch my men! My... My gooder! Thank you. Go to bed, dude. Right, so let's, let's put it, I don't have any torches. Yeah. Right, let's, just, let's make a couple of torches. I don't have much in the way of uh, copper, I mean coal left, but this should be good. Can you go to bed now? Thank you very much. Why, why are you running to the darkest part of the woods? <laughs> let's go to bed. All right, this is good. This is good. Everybody's in bed. We can go take a quick little... No, he's not in bed yet. Now he's going to bed. Perfect. Yes, all corners are tucked into bed. Beautiful. Everybody's going to be stuck in bed until the raid is over, uh, which we, of course, can defend in the morning. So now I'm going to go to bed as well, and we'll see uh, how this attack is going to uh, progress in the next episode, of course, because right now I am out of time. We are just a little bit over. Um, but if you enjoyed the episode, leave a like. If you didn't leave us a like, it's fine. And I will see you guys in the next one. We'll, I'll just beat away this attack. And then we can get back to uh, doing what we do best, which is build. Anyways, have a great day or evening. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.